<laughs> Still using those beans. We we have to use the beans. It's, Without the beans, we're nothing. Like that's just what our shirts should be. Just one big bean on one on the front, and the other big bean on the back. And one of them says "next time" on the back, <laughs> and the other one it says "on the next time." Okay, let's. Uh, we're getting there. We're all we're all ready. We were ready to begin with. What's up, Mr. Heel? Hey, Beans. Tyrant Heel and I well, went axe throwing. I know. I, I. So I thought we were just going to play board games, and I was really tired, so I'm like, oh, I can miss board games. Well. I probably wouldn't have missed axe throwing. Yeah, sucks to be you, because yep. we threw axes. It seems pretty cool. Yeah, it's fun. I was glad that I uh, was still able to do it, and I hadn't forgotten how, since I hadn't done it in like 12 years. I've Longer than that. I've never even thrown an axe. I'd say 2006. So that's like 15 years. Jeez. College was so long ago. College was forever ago, but less for me. Oh, he was late. It's like 20 minutes late. Way to go. So how's the uh, How's the audio mix there, Tyrant Heal? Yeah, we can directly control it. I... I already know I'm much, much closer to the mic. Might have to turn myself down. I don't think you're down. closer. It's just louder. Because I'm pretty close to mine. Uh, well, I'm, I'm very. I'm very close. I'm very close. So close. So now I just have to talk very softly. Yeah, get those recycled cans. Hey! Hey! This is great. What's going on? Um, thanks. I'm Yellow. glad that the audio sounds good. Uh, we have recently changed the audio setup. We by we, <laughs> by we, I mean definitely me. I helped a lot. Uh, and by, we are by we have, showing up, and it was already done. <laughs> we have changed the. That is Def Louder, but Tim overall good balance. Yeah. Yeah. I think. It's just, uh, you know, I've just generally generally quieter throughout my whole life. Tim could be louder. Oh, I was telling Matt we should have been streaming 15 minutes ago because we had there were so many fixes. Oh, we yeah we did. It is great to see you too. Thanks for stopping by. What can I do here? Oh, I'll just pull it away. So it's finally uh, cooler weather. Yes, we have for a couple of days. And I'm sorry that it sounds so good. I feel like heel. it's 50 degrees out, and no matter what you're drinking, it has to be with two hands. Oh yeah, it's, it's cozy, super cold. It's a cozy way to drink. Oh, now we're getting into some Final Fantasy bosses. No, we can't see you. Wish we could. Metaphorically. We can metaphorically see you. Yes. No, not even. I guess, maybe. Maybe. Oh, Ooh. what? I'm bound. You got, all, you, got all, um, you got all tied up there. I sure did. There's not much I can do about it right now. You getting? Dra oh my gosh! Look at what's dragging you in there. I don't. I don't like it at all. You gotta assess that bee. Oh, you're right. It's been so long since I've assessed anything. You gotta assess. What's a metaphor? Meh. Let's see your abilities. What's a butt for? Let's bear it. Yeah. So how's uh, how's the new city or the the new That's old city? Right. The new old city that you are currently living in. Is that working out? Oh yeah, new old city. <laughs> I don't know, like how we're, we're not that we're, is. we're not that far from uh, any town USA. Not, that's right. <laughs> Our geographic location, hell cheap. I'm saying, like, and it's probably even more expensive than it is here. Uh, which is like one of the one of the only benefits of living in this place where we live <laughs> is the like staggeringly low cost of living, relatively. Relatively, I mean, even where we are is high for the state. Yes, in any old state, city, it really <laughs> would be a good, a good setting. New old city. No escape. Atrocity. Did you assess that queen grass? I did. Nice. Deeply into the cheap of where I live. Oh yeah, it's it's just like. I mean, 
say your age without saying your age, but like the property tax here, really great. Ow. Do an Omni Slash. I don't know what that means. I can't do anything right now. You, are you poisoned? You're gonna die. I you're, can't do anything right now. Look. Real soon. Oh, there it is. I can use <laughs> Barret. Barret. No, oh, Barret's yeah. gonna heal me. Oh, okay. So I, I just didn't can... have any like abilities points. When did this game get Zergs? Yeah, they're really doing a Zerg rush right now. Oh, I can't. I do have a summon. And it is Ifrit, but I I don't know what like I can do to trigger that. Cozy drink. Nope. I was not in the water main break. Do you mean like, were we there when it broke or are we affected by it? I was not affected by it. I'm pretty sure it's just West Lafayette. I mean, uh, I where? Mean, where? <laughs> I mean, uh, <laughs> where again? I mean, um, Shelbyville? North Ogdenbrook? <laughs> Eagleton? It's in Eagleton. It is in Eagleton, yes. Speaking of Eagleton, your son really is bringing home the bacon, being directly from Pawnee. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just mouth all on that bubbler. <laughs> yeah, we're using bubbler. You don't know where we're from. Taste outside my house? Please explain. Matt's house. That's the same as my house, or like previously. Yeah. Did someone get tased outside your house? All good. Not recently. I mean, well, ever? Uh, I, that sounds familiar. Like the old, the old yeah, place. Yeah, like the old where we used to live next to each other. Old new, old new city. Yeah. Ooh, Barrett, you almost died years Those ago. Really me out. Ooh, Barrett did almost die. Good thing you're algebra smart. An accident, they will. When it's too late then. East Chauncey. <laughs> North City. I forget, where are you? Where are we currently? Just doing another job, like some reactor. <laughs> Who's algebra smart? <laughs> That's this guy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so story time, I guess. Story time. Uh, we were all at um, my old house, hanging out on in my backyard on the deck, and we'd be kind of loud. We're playing loud games. There's oh, we love playing loud games. Eight of us, and we hear this knocking coming from like my fence, like the gate. And it, yeah, you do. And it was this like woman, and it happened to be September 11th. Oop, that's why we were celebrating. <laughs> Yeah, but she was like, "Can I hang out with you?" Because she was saying that she lost someone on September 11th, and it, oh yeah, and she needed to be by people. I think that we're missing at least a little bit of context from I the can't, story. It's so long ago. So but. the the beginning of the story, I would say, is um, we were hanging out in the backyard, that's, as, I, as that's Tim how said. We started it. I know, but you went away because someone knocked at the gate. That's what I said. And then you came back. <laughs> We didn't know. Oh, yeah. But you came back, and there was someone in tow. <laughs> someone came with me. Like, and we were, like, across the yard of the what? gate. Came back. It was like, this is Bobby Joe. Yeah. It's just this lady who is, like, kind of insane. And she just hung out with us for a few hours. A few saying hours. Saying all kinds of stuff. Like, like man, oh, so you're algebra smart. <laughs> because I was I was in my sweater vest stage. <laughs> he was wearing I was yeah. wearing a sweater vest. A sweater vest. It's like, oh, you, you must be algebra smart. And then, uh, Urkel smart. She asked if we had any sweatpants she could put on. Yeah. And our friend was like, nah, we used them all in the flash mob. <laughs> flash mob. Let's just give it a quick once over and call it. We're, yeah, we're in. No sweater vest currently. Nope. Um, what else did she do? Oh. Uh, we let her in our house to use the bathroom. Because we don't have any, like, prescriptions. No, there wasn't a flash mob. She asked us for to have some of that green stuff, which was which no blue shit. It oh, was Bombay. Shit. It was yeah, Bombay. Um, and then just to like get out of our house, we were like, let's not. We're gonna go ahead to the bar. 
and I think she wasn't allowed in that particular bar, but we didn't know that at the time, but we went anyway. She seemed really nervous about it. Oh, she was like, they're gonna kick me out. Oh, because last time she was like, last time I was in there, I got naked. She's like, don't make me take off don't my clothes. Don't make me take off my pants. And we're like, no nope, one's gonna make no, you. No, nobody here. I'm gonna turn on my gain. I am peaking. Gain. Get gains. Um. Oh, and she w she said that uh, when she was little, people used to make fun of her. Uh, she said, don't laugh. But they used to, <laughs> they used to call me Bucky O'Hare because of oh my, my oh my god because of my <laughs> teeth. And then our friend Joe laughed, and she was like, ah! It was the situation of, okay, she's like, I'm going to tell you this. It's it's really hard. <clears throat> Don't laugh. laugh. And so it was dead silence. <laughs> and she says it, and then Joe just cracks, and we're like, like, come on. Uh, so Come funny. on. Oh, and then she, <laughs> she, so she sat by you at the bar. Did she, did she ever? I got lost. We went to the bar, and I didn't. I yeah, got sidetracked because there was this table of people playing you euchre. Bailed, and they you like, bailed while you they left like, us all. Gave me a look because they saw her come in with us, and I stopped there to talk to them. And uh, then I played some euchre with them. You fucking bailed. And, and then everyone's like, "Where'd Tim go?" And I was just like sitting at a table with strangers playing euchre. Yeah, that's called. <laughs> so I have. Uh, How, like I have no idea. Timeless. A actually, some audio from the situation because the person who <laughs> came up with the flash mob thing he recorded the whole thing. He recorded. Thing. He recorded like all this audio. I keep trying to get more of it, but I only have like a snippet. But it is real. It did exist, and it was Can't very awkward and, re and like weird. I freak out times, but yeah, for real. No one even had a mask on. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go now. But then I then I uh, did end up back with the group and. Yeah, after all the stuff went down. Because she ended up, as soon as, you know, here's the thing. As soon as we said we're not buying her booze or, or giving her any more yeah. booze, she, she was like, got nah. the fuck out of there. It yeah. was immediate. It's like, that's all we had to do? Once we weren't buying her drinks, she was like, oh, I'm going to go find some other people. That's all we had to do. She uh, uh, she was probably like that's 30s, maybe 40s. Probably. She wasn't that her, old. Her boyfriend not her boyfriend her husband oh, she was not her the, husband the, box, the local boxer she knew the, all the local boxers local boxers the local the boxing no scene what we're looking for somewhere inside and that in a cloud of winston <laughs> lights for real for real that, that was is that was at the uh the the checkerboard the old checkerboard oh that's this the potential location i'm sure that there's more, more than one bar <laughs> that she is was the local box all right report, report. All right. That's some fun mic sounds over there. Trying to lower it a little bit. We don't have the um, the cool things that like suppress vibration, so every you hear everything. You can hear everything. It's true. I was just trying to get out of my face so much. I was just talking to somebody about Bobby Joe the other day, and it was like, was it this chat right now? No. <laughs> But it, it was honestly like we were so glad to have had that experience. So, it was a good story. Because it's so funny. You no yeah, the checkerboard. And, yep. and it, like in retrospect, it was like, oh, we just let this like stranger, strange tweaker just come into our backyard and hang out with us. Yep, we all did. We, <laughs> we all <laughs> we were, let that we happen. All let her in. We all did it. What were we supposed to do? Say no, you can't come in and hang out with this sad old lady on 9/11. Yes. That's probably true. <laughs> yes. This is the Mega Bev. How do I do it? <laughs> Thank you, Tom. <laughs> yes. Yes. Well, listen, it's just, you know, it's the hospitality. She, she did. Though. She did. She did. She she made it all the way into the into the because, back room. Because yeah, she made it into the back room cuz we were trying to we were trying to ditch her. We were coming up with things to try to get like like let her <laughs> like get her to, to go away and um so we went to the bar and we just went to the back and um, I was we couldn't just tell her to leave because we had invited her in. Yes, again, we're using we pretty liberally. And and the rules of the Midwest say <laughs> you can't just ask someone to leave. You have to strongly hint. Do we I went so far as to just all of us left my house and went to a second location so that we could leave her at the oh, second right, location. I, what? I missed the, what I'm actually supposed <laughs> yeah. to be doing. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't know the last time I was here. In the bar area. Slap, lap, wheel. 
Oh, Bay Area. I was like, the bar area. The bar yeah, area, area bus. bus. Oh, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, it was... Um, I remember, like, we sat down... You weren't there. You had left <laughs> us. Uh, touch the door handle. Got yep. a seat for you well, right here. Come well, on, have a seat. Well... So, oh, and yeah. she asked you to buy her a blowjob shot. She was in my ear because it was like a bar, pretty late, and she like got in, like just in the side of my ear, and just like slobbering all over. And her, all being you like, heard was all I heard shot was blowjob. And, blowjob. and I'm like, hell no, <laughs> this night is not taking this much of a turn. Buy me a shot of a blowjob. All right, this is a family show. Oh yeah, sure. Now it is. It's a family show. Yeah, um, I didn't. Again, that was the that was the um, what we got her to leave that was, was the night, Matt. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. What are we doing here? We don't need century launcher. Oh my gosh! The there is a drink called oh, that. Yeah, it's, it's a shot. Remembering all. Yeah, that's what she was asking for. And boy, did Matt mishear her. I did. I was already on. All of the edge. Because <laughs> of how algebra smart you were. Yes. You are getting attacked on all, I'm on all sides. I'm moving away. Yeah, roll away, Cloud. Bird, baby, burn. Bird, baby, burn? What year is it? I don't know. Shinra year. Way to go, butt wipe. Feel the heat. Feel the heat. Gotta be careful. Yeah, I do gotta be careful. It's now Matt's partner. Yep, she's upstairs right now. Yep. Uh, we got married. And now <laughs> I'm the boxer boyfriend. You really should have just done it. But then I should have just done she it. She probably wouldn't have left. And I just said no, and she left. It was great. That's true, yeah. And then I was like, ah. Oh, no, I remember. So the the Euchre people were like, what's the story there? And so I sat down to tell them the story, and we played Euchre, and they were like, oh, we'll just steal you Fucking in. hell. So I was telling them the story. And then, uh... Later on, we walked through the room, and they looked at me, and I said, the story continues. <laughs> Get <laughs> fucked. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was so funny. So funny. Disco is huge in Shinra. It was 9-11. That's true. It was 9-11. Anything goes. I actually don't remember that aspect of the story. I don't. I didn't remember it being 9-11. That was the reason she gave for, like, why she should be able to hang out with us, because she lost, like, her cousin on 9-11, and she's just been so sad ever since i think okay it's coming back to me like she didn't lose her cousin 9-11 because of the towers because of the oh, she yeah. just lost her cousin on 9-11 <laughs> yeah like a different year or something shinra is the company that in this game are they like, trying to attack antagonists yeah. <laughs> and Actually, I, I think I'm we're here, the antagonists and i'm here to tell you that person is now my wife <laughs> uh yep Celebrating, not over yet. what would it be, like 10 years now? Yep. That was like 10 was, years ago. That was some crazy story. Motherfucker. Named 911. <laughs> 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 I'm sure it was all BS. I'm sure it wasn't. Absolutely BS. Like, she just wanted alcohol and drugs. And we kept giving them to her. <laughs> So our friends said that, like, they thought they saw her uh, somewhere else a few years later. Um, and we would, we would like, watch the police blotter for her name every once in a while. One in Montana. <laughs> Eating fish heads under the bridge. <laughs> I mean, if fish heads is another word for drugs, then I'm sure, yes. That's what she was doing. All right, let's go. She might have been a ghost. Vaccinating? Vaccinating? What is that from? Fish heads. I mean, there's a song from like, um, who's that radio guy that Weird Al liked a lot? Do Dr. Demento? Dr. Demento, yeah. Yeah, fish heads. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dr. Demento. We got it. It's Dr. Demento. Only Golem Gollum is the head of a fish. It's Dr. Demento. Grunar Monk. No escape. Classic. We, we were just <laughs> talking about uh, the night we all made a, our best friend Bobby Joe. Where we made our suicide pact. 
Bill said, listen, if I'm 40 and not married, like, we're gonna, we gotta all marry Bobby Joe. No, that's mine. You can't. <laughs> Please, sir, my wets. Not looking good. It is not looking good. Cloud's about to die. Yeah, he is. In the nick of time. Run away, run away. You were there, uh, right? Bruno Monk, you were there that night. Where pretty, there pretty that? sure. Pretty sure he was there. Right? Yeah. Unless that was when he was in the other part of USA. Yeah, there, there are some moments in our collective history that. Gooby Joe. Gooby Joe. <laughs> Gooby and Dolan. Gooby. Gooby. <laughs> she's, she's here to fulfill the pact. We made a promise. Does that mean nothing to you? <laughs> this was this is like a, a very important story. There's a lot of people's lore built up in this. No, Malk didn't say the flash mob thing. That was our our mutual friend who was also a mayoral candidate here locally. <laughs> yes. And he got very very much of the vote. He did get a percentage. He a, did. A non-zero number. He did. He got yeah, a non-zero. Yeah, he wasn't there. Were you in a uh, new teaching location? <laughs> that was not one of the weekends you drove two and a half hours each way to come see us. One of his biggest regrets, not being there for Gooby Joe. Yeah, that's a bad one. I would, I would probably hate myself if I wasn't there for that. That's a false one. That was... I'll tell you, it's funny as a story. I was miserable during that whole thing. <laughs> I, I was having a great time. Because not only that, like, she was next to me a lot of that night. Yep. Oh, and we saw her at, uh, we saw her later at um, Kirby's. Kirby's? At a bar. And she was sitting up, like, on, on the landing. And she had sweatpants and gym shorts on. But she had her sweatpants, like, pulled, like, all the way down. And she was sitting there playing Pac-Man or something. And, and we were all at the bottom like, isn't that Bobby Joe up there? <laughs> like, is that her? Come on. Come I on. do remember that time Grunar Malk helped that guy try and win mayor. <laughs> oh, yeah, you went canvassing. Oh, wait. It's got thunder? Yeah, let's use that on that. Hell, yeah. That probably did so much damage. It did. It's a good thing those crates are there. That Oh, yeah, let's do this. Done. Dead. I didn't know that Barrett had that spell. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about that. I think it would just be like an awkwardness competition. I lost. Like who can out awkward the other? Oh, and then our, our other friends who were there said that they, when they left the bar, oh, yeah, they felt like she was following them, like chasing them down the alley. Cause they, oh, that's right, they saw her on like the next street over. Cause she was she like left. She was like knocking she doors. She was knocking on someone's door, and they, and at the time he had like hurt his ankle, so he was limping. <laughs> and they felt like it was a horror movie where they were trying to get away from her and she was just going to be, like, getting a house closer each time they looked but still knocking on the doors. I stayed at your place that night, and I just remember, like, up in your upper in, area. In, in my <laughs> upper area? I don't know what you want to call it. An attic? <laughs> it was an attic, but the it was like a bedroom. upstairs bedroom? Upstairs bedroom. That's better. Upper area? <laughs> well, I was deep inside your upper area. <laughs> always always <laughs> carried on pills and cushions. Always comfy. When I was in Tim's upper area, I just remember like having a sigh of relief after that night was over. I'm like, it's Fuck. over. <laughs> we were, we made it. We made it through. Smother. <laughs> She's always ready to smother someone. It's like I want this duty. Like please let it fall to me. We should be reaching that secret passage. Good. A new plan he wouldn't build. Should have called it Plan X. Uh, we gotta tell more stories. Uh, um, uh, uh, God. Let's make it up. Don't blow it. There's one time. Oh, God. Oh, not too much. What's that supposed to mean? 
if that would make you comfortable. I mean, the sweet, sweet embrace of this the death was show. Abandoned. Oh, that is a good Isn't story, that? actually. That is a good story, but... Um, are you referring to, like, the, the show uh, for the Michiana Deaf Society? <laughs> yeah, you should tell that one. Is that Sylvester Stallone voiceover? So, uh, yes. <laughs> Please subscribe to our Patreon. <laughs> we don't have one. We should get a Patreon. We don't have enough fan. Or product. We don't have anything. We don't do anything to deserve a Patreon. Michiana story. Okay, so we... Uh, yeah, I was not here for this one. We're in a college one. improv group. Uh, me and uh, Nervous Hair, Grunart Malk. Yeah, Shavan M. Uh, we got hired by this group called like the Michiana Deaf and Hearing Impaired Society. And being college kids, we assumed that these were also college kids. For some reason, we were like, oh yeah, sweet. It'll just be like a bunch of like dope, like deaf dudes or like whatever. They hired us for an improv show. It's going to be fun. And then on the way up, we're like, oh, it's at the whatever, like Wakarusa maybe? Wakarusa Public Library? <laughs> they came to us. Yeah, they hired us. I don't know why. They um, found our website. <laughs> they Googled I Indiana Improv or something. But we show up there and we realize we're going to be doing the show for like six elderly people <laughs> in a public library. <laughs> And so our uh, boy, do I have one of those stories that isn't this one? <laughs> it's, yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it was like Wakarusa, but which is the middle of nowhere. But that might not be right. I might be getting that wrong. Um, so like our um, I don't know, like our president, our captain, our MC Andrew. He like does our opening bit where it's like he's trying to get the audience jazzed up for the show, and we run in like with energy, and then we do that. And then the, they like s start their meeting. <laughs> it's so their their president or whatever is like, ah, thank you. If everyone could please sit down, we'll go around the circle, and everyone can introduce themselves and say why they're here. And by the way, this whole meeting is being um, there's somebody a stenographer who is not there. The stenographer is listening because th they have a speakerphone on. And the stenographer is listening from, like, Michigan and is <laughs> typing what they hear, and it's being projected on a screen so that the, the deaf and hearing impaired old people, elderly people, can, can, can look at what is being, is being said. So, <gasps> so just the introductions happen, and um, that all gets mangled by the the stenographer you know like they, it was so bad uh you know andrew is like well uh, my name's andrew he's the one who started the show and i'm here to say <laughs> i'm here to say no he was like and uh you know i came here in a big white forward arrow star van and the stenographer wrote name andrew i came in a big white four-year-old <laughs> And then, uh, not to out nervous hair or anything, but I'm going to go ahead and say your real name because it's funny. He stands up there and he says, my name is Athanasio Seglaris and I'm blah, 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 blah. And the stenographer types nothing for a very long time and then writes, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then we did the show. And Steve, they didn't laugh. They didn't laugh the entire time. Not one person <laughs> laughed, probably because they couldn't hear anything and they had to wait. Everything was like a 20-second delay. Jokes are always delay. good on a delay. <laughs> the only time they laughed was when Andrew, again, did like a panda bear impression. <clears throat> he was like, how, how, how. And they thought that was the funniest thing. They cracked up at that and then nothing else. And I don't think we got paid. I think they gave us gas money. Great. Like, thanked us for our trouble. This it. And then we, we all went out and got pizza. Yeah, like the the one laugh. Whew. Ooh, does this look like a boss? Like a big a pretty, train it was, boss? This is a pretty fun. Uh, some, oh yeah, no, there was a poop joke. Yeah, some they did laugh at a poop joke. Who doesn't laugh at a poop joke? 
Correct. I mean, yeah, nobody. I just pulled it out of my ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, oh, that was it was great. We also did a library show. Oh my god! In a so I was group. I was there for that one. Yep. That was for like three people, and two of them came with us. Fuck. Yeah, there was three three people total, two children, and one blind one gentleman. Blind. I forgot he was blind. He was very blind. Oh. And then also like my wife. Bring it down. My wife. Guys, like partner were there. Uh, and yeah, Anne was there. We did get pizza money. And they gave us pizza money. So maybe I got those two things confused. But. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Doing it at a reunion show? Are you going to be in it? I was really pleased with the uh, alumni show that I forced our old group to do. <laughs> that was good. It was really fun, but I like definitely made it happen. And I want to make the next one happen, too. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. That Bobby was Joe. Oh, yeah, she Oh yeah, she came. Bobby Joe. Uh, Bobby Joe's here with us right now. Yeah. She's just, always with us. Just out of frame. That is true. Paid shows. Always bad. Always bad. We've done show. What, we did a show at like a sorority during like a pancake breakfast. Oh, no, nobody. <laughs> nobody, nobody was Nobody could hear us. Yeah. There were there were hundreds of people in the sorority house. It was it was madness. And it was so loud we couldn't hear each other. And we had microphones, and we were playing games like, like the dating game, and stuff like that. And like no one. No one could hear anything. But we all left and we're just like, hey, remember, we just made some money. <laughs> no, I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, I and I, I doubt, honestly, I doubt that improv group, the one we were in, would ever, would ever do that. They're way too Oh, yeah, I can see too cool. You're up. Oh, yeah. The show, what was that for? The, the dance marathon? We were doing this show during a dance marathon, so it was loud and crazy anyway. But then there was across the giant like room, there was a projector, and they were just updating the basketball score. It wasn't even a live feed; it was just like every few minutes it would update. And we, there were more people staring at that across the room, cheering, than there were watching our improv show and like laughing at it. This just goes to the, the, the show how how good we were. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, appreciate it. Super good to, to hear from you. Absolutely. I would love to hang out with you all. In undisclosed Sometimes location. <laughs> yes. In a secret location. On some date and time. Because it is not too far away from our current location. I don't think they're filling Lily. They're they're definitely doing shows in uh, in Fowler and in, in Low Low. Yeah. Low in Low. But yeah. I wouldn't give them Lily Cloud just now. They're still going. I just saw a bunch of posters for um, uh, auditions for our group. Both of them. Both of them. Yeah. Yeah. They're. All, I mean, I don't. I don't have any bad feelings about any of them. Nope. Well, especially yeah. But there was a little beef for a while, but no worries. That murder game. Murder game. Which murder game? Oh, Among Us. Oh yeah. Yeah, we should play Among yeah. Us. Yeah, I'd be up for that. Absolutely. I'd, I'd be down. Um, in maybe like three or four years when we're done with this game. I don't I don't genuinely think we're gonna finish this game. Yeah, we'll get sick of it. Ooh. Yeah. Did you summon that that dude? I sure did. Ooh. Check this out. Sips tea. Oh, uh, for real. But we did just throw axes. So, you know. Things getting. It is not it. Oh. Oh, I should probably assess this, right? Say more about axes. Oh yeah, we went to the um, the spinning axe. Downtown. Another thing I wasn't a part of. Uh, Cause you chose not to come. I was so tired. We threw axes. It's pretty good time. Pretty good time. Mm. Went pretty well. 
I was a little little worried I, I would have lost my uh, my axe throwing skills. Cause I used to do it semi regularly. No brag, no brag. In college. But that, what I mean is when my girlfriend at the time dragged me to Ren Fairs, I would go find the axe throwing area and just do that until it was time to go. Oh, I didn't get any bullseyes, but I just like consistently hit fours and threes. Except the one time I had to get one, uh, Tyrant Hill and I just went back and forth not hitting one Shit. for like Shit. 10 rounds. Get yeah, get off yeah. those third rails, dude. I did. Not everybody, though. Oh, yeah, how many how many bullseye did you get? How many bullseye? I'm having hard to look time to look at the chat. I'm sorry. Also, who did, uh, Grassy Jane, who did you go x zone with? Was it like, um, in an x fire? I don't know who would win in an x fire. Someone who got the most bullseye. Bullseye. <laughs> Uh, vegan bolognese. <laughs> it's a vegan bolognese. <laughs> the vegan uh, bolognese. The bolognese. Cure that train thing. I, I'm trying to hide from it. There's nowhere to hide. They took away my cover. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I saw something. Maybe on Facebook or someone said something. Did I see? No, did somebody I say Facebook. Somebody say booger. Shit. Get out of the way, Tifa. Do I have to manually move her? Well, I mean, if you don't move her, who's gonna? That'd be a cool, that'd be a fun, like, after school coworker hangout, though. Feels oh, yeah. Do you see this assessment? Crab Warden. Crippling its parts significantly fills An its stagger. model. I have to cripple its parts. Hot. Get it, Barrett. Get it, Barrett. I almost crippled all its parts. <laughs> Microphone noises. Well, so in my, I, I, oh my gosh, I kind of felt that way too about the drinking and the sharp objects. But really, the like the drinking it was very secondary. So you're spending all your time throwing axes, and you're not allowed to hold your drinks while you're doing it. So. Oh, limit break. Hell yeah, I'm going to save that. But I just had a couple of Diet Cokes. Because it was a school night. All right, now it is time to limit my breaks. Okay, limit it. Crab Warden. That makes it okay. I think they, they have it set up really safe. Um, I would be surprised if anybody actually got hurt there. The only time uh, I could see it happening, like one time I threw it harder than normal. Because I was really trying to bullseye it and it hit the bullseye but with the flat part of the the head and it bounced straight back to me but it, i mean it hit the ground and got almost back to me but i don't think anybody would be able to would, would throw it hard enough i mean i'm sure they could and probably have but let's go they've got i think they've got pretty set up pretty safe i've destroyed the big bag also it was super fun congratulations to me and now I want to buy an axe and make they are a useful in tools. my backyard. Sweet. I want to do that. It's been so long since I've gone this shooting. Like, God. 15 so, years? I haven't shot a gun since high school. Yeah, done. that's about the, like, uh, even before that. Was registered during the test. An anomaly. And even then it was like your failure to properly prepare the armor. cool poses no, in here. Jojo poses. Fully operational. It's far more likely, given the circumstances, that the sensors were overloaded. Uh, I'm so sorry. What kind of poses are you doing in that mirror? <laughs> that, oh, axe poses. You're just saying like, what so? if I do this? All the I amputated my dog. Inoperable. Mike Wazowski? No, the secretary. Mike Wazowski. He's not the secretary. <laughs> he's everything. Oh, no, he's watching. <laughs> Mike Wazowski? You forgot to file your paperwork. Yes. Mike, yes. you forgot to file your paperwork. I'm always watching. Everything is fine, sir. 
That is still my favorite Pixar movie. It's great. It's really good. Yes. Look, it should, sir. Yeah, you can't take the axe into the bathroom no. with you. You'll, um, you'll chop off your dangle. We know exactly right. Where they were headed. That is exactly <laughs> the concern. The is intact, then you'd best determine the nature of this anomaly. Mike Wachowski. <laughs> yeah, they made the uh, Matrix. <laughs> the Wazowski brothers. Who's Roz? Tim and I both did him. Should yep, yeah, yeah specify. So, you will deal with our intruders personally. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Subordinate. That's Don't my name. Worry. Don't I worry. Treat my people more than fair. <laughs> yeah, he wasn't even in the bathroom. He just he just got his dangle out and chopped it off. <laughs> he was like, I'll teach you to beat me in 21. Matt's Roz. Okay. I was like Stimpy? <laughs> like yeah, from, uh, from Ren, Ren and Stimpy? The passage is beyond these shipping containers. <laughs> Let's, Let's slip, slip through them. You just climb Talk over the top. A tight squeeze. Oh, that that does it. not look like a tight squeeze. You okay? There's plenty of airspace around all. Well, of I'm a tiny, like little pretty boy, and Barrett's a big, strong gunman. Yeah, but look at how so big your muscles are. You bump into oh yeah, they're huge. Like that in reactor one. Yeah, except a bath. Look at this like a specimen. Speaking of which, <laughs> this Adonis. Huh? Uh. Run, run, run. Well, um, looks dead now. It's you know the news. It's it's hard to know which which one you're in. Urine, urine town. Oh boy, that is that is a lot of noise. It's so it's, it's, it's so clear with these new mics. It's double-handed sipping weather. You gotta blow in the hole. You gotta blow. <laughs> you gotta blow on the seltzer. All aboard. Hey, do you guys have um? Oh man, mm. I. I know what. What Cozy. is he? The um, the hot seltzer. <laughs> can I get a hot <laughs> seltzer? I uh, just just put it in the microwave. Uh, can you um? Can you make me a hot seltzer? All right. You're getting a little too Howard in the chat. <laughs> a lot of Howard going on. A little too Howard. I'm pointing at this, but I should be pointing at that. Point at that. It's up there. The Howard is up there. It's in. The Howard was in you all along. <laughs> the Howard was in you. That's not really a magic hubcap. <laughs> just so you. Okay, easy. man. We know. <laughs> when did it ever? Bonk? Yes. Bonk? Bring out the horny police. Bring out the horny bat. <laughs> bonk? bonk? Yeah. It's the dog that has the bonk. It's when you post it when people are getting way too oh, Howard yeah, online. Bonk. Yeah. Yeah, I've, I've realized that anytime uh, Veracity Jane says a thing I don't understand, it's probably just a meme. <laughs> it is a meme. I'm trying to get the Howard out. Yeah, and straight on to react to you already did. You did it with an axe. Listen, no amount of whatever you're doing is going to get the Howard out. <laughs> Unless, you know what? Keep that to your lonesome. Whatever anybody does during Tim and Matt play, you can do it. Just don't let us know. It's just going to awaken the Howard. And not, it's just going to keep it there. He was the last. This year is such a good for Howard. <laughs> we cut through section G and head for H. H in the a chat. Platform and H will get us closer to the reactor. Ho. Oh. Biggs should be somewhere over there. Yeah. Oh, Biggs. Yeah, he's the hot one. Looks like the sun's going down. Oh, we got one H. H in the chat. <laughs> right. Double time. Double time. Look at that. Look at that tattoo. <laughs> please, <laughs> please, please, no, please. I don't know how many times I have to ask this. No. <laughs> Just already seen so much. Look how dangerous this ladder is. Yeah. Oh no, it's not that dangerous. Show feet. <laughs> this is a show hole only got, show. <laughs> Listen, this is not the place place for feet things. <laughs> Nothing but air below us. Okay, Barrett. Just don't look down, okay? Easy for you to <laughs> Who <laughs> made this platform? Shinra. I bet the fuck the subscriber. <laughs> Section G's through here, huh? We're gonna start a Patreon, but when you pay us a certain amount, you have to send us materials. Yeah. This we just ask for more and more. That's how it goes. Yeah. This could get into a legal gray area, and by legal gray area, we're going away to no prison. <laughs> we're, going, 
Needs power, I think. That looks more like what we need. What? Does, control room. does oh. cease and desist seem a little redundant to you? Let's check it out. Cease and desist. Yeah. Stop and stop. Stop. Stop again. Stop. Like, we, we got it. Stop it. We got it. Stop what you're doing and uh, stop it. Like, does it mean stop it and also don't do it anymore? <laughs> I think stop and really stop. Like, stop your current action and also never do the action again? Maybe. Stop. Like, collaborate and listen. Yeah. Stop in the name of love. Yes. Stop dragging my car around. That's the weird out. Switch for the Stop way. dragging my heart around. Yes. I don't know what I'm doing at the moment. Looks like you're running around with no idea where to go. Yeah, correct. That is correct. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know, man. Whatever content you want to give us. We are content <laughs> with your you content. Leave my heart around alone. <laughs> what? <laughs> heart around. This chat has gotten way too Howard, way too quickly. Heart around. Stop dragging my heart around. <laughs> Took me a minute. Restore the power. I thought that's what I was doing. Listen, restore the power. Maybe no one uses that option. Yeah, maybe. Oh, there they are. Yeah, that's where he pointed. Oh, excuse me. Wow. Yeah, burping on stream. It's because I have all this hot seltzer. <laughs> you have a hot claw? <laughs> it's just like a, a white claw, but I swarmed up. Put it over the oven. I just held it for a few hours. <laughs> of course. Held it in my armpits. Instructions for dealing with the power shortage. Hey, oh. instructions for us. Hey, look. We have power for the gate and other stuff. Man, no, Legal stuff. doublet. You think these that was my nickname in high school. The, closest thing the internet tells me build. cease and desist is a legal Gotta doublet. Sun, That's what just I, I, ju gate, I just huh? said legal doublet. But if we go through with it, Hot the claw. in sector four will suffer. Now or later, sun's going out for good. We'll that screen capture. Which screen capture? That's true. Oh, the one with the... Look, oh, it's the thing. look. <clears throat> A legal doublet. <laughs> Here's the thing about a legal doublet. You have to limber up first. <laughs> Maybe. You gotta stretch. You, you, you gotta stretch. You're gonna hurt yourself. And you gotta you gotta tell people before yeah. you do it. Yes. <clears throat> yeah, legal doublet. Legal doublet. Was my nickname in high school. L legal doublet. Legal doublet. Legal doublet. That'd be a pretty good band name, though. I can already guarantee you that the description for this YouTube video when I post it is going to say legal doublet. Hey, everybody, we're legal doublet. <laughs> we're going to play some songs we wrote uh, at our house. I uh, hope you uh, enjoy them. I already was up we're here. Start, I was already ahead of the game. We're going to start the songs very soon. We are Sex Bob. -omb. We're gonna sing songs about making you sad and stuff, or something like that. Yeah. Cease and desist. In the name of love. <laughs> Cease and desist. <laughs> Collaborate and listen. <laughs> Illegal doublet. Whoa. Okay, that's that. Great job, Cloud. Yeah. What? <laughs> Thanks. A I pulled a lever. Yeah. Whoa, a puzzle. I like fought a. Semi sentient train know, monster, look, get but, here. but pulling the level. Wow, the lever, Cloud, great job. Really? Oh, yeah. That lever looked really hard to pull. You're so strong. Oh, Bourbon Doublet does sound pretty good. Bourbon Doublet. Giblet. I want to go to some can bars I, and just ask for nonsense drinks. Yeah, can I get a Bourbon Doublet? <laughs> okay, yeah. Not again. Can I get a triple double? Great. I'm sure those that's a welcome us that's a uh, in and out burger. Yeah. <laughs> Tell you Studio what, Giblet. The rock runs deep in this damn pizza. Insta Gib. Did he just say the rock runs deep in this pizza? Rot. In the pizza? I think in this place. He said pizza. You said pizza. Let me get a hot claw. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Just like mom used to make. <laughs> we didn't have a refrigerator. I can't really go to bed until I've had my hot claw. 
triple double is a sex tuplet. I guess that's true. That's true. It's technically true. I feel like we're bringing the Howard now. We're yeah. We're, we're tapping. We're like it. intentionally. We're tapping the Howard. Leaning into the Howard. Yes. Mariner sex <laughs> tuplet. They busted. Howard down. Ooh, guess. they're not the only one busting. One less thing wow. Bust to worry wow. About. Once you start, you can't stop. Like there's some flying things. I do see that. W watch out! <laughs> Don't yeah. talk. I have to have my morning hot claw. I need my morning hot claw. It's like uh, flying fish sure things. Like Little it. hot claw and Vicodin exactly. to start the day. <laughs> In the tunnels, I need mm. my uppers and my downers. It all goes back He's up, up, up. No, it's down. Because I down, need down. to get up, but I can't get too up. And I can't get up until I get down, if you hot know what I mean. Doublet. Can I get a double hot claw? <laughs> Neat. <laughs> With ice. Hot claw on the rocks. You get a hot toddy on the rocks. Oh, of course. That really fell all apart at once. Yeah. Cloud, are you okay? Oh my God, Cloud. Going for that material, weren't you? Oh, you yeah, greedy, duh. you greedy, you greedy. I was jerk. going for the material. Greedy. I, was, I just want it. Now this path's I'm no sure good, Cloud. No all because you tried to walk on it. Now we can't walk I on it. I just wanted to walk and on when we it. Find it. We can find a snag that material. Irish hot claw. If I fall in, I can't get up. I mean, if if this, then that, right? So if yes. I have fallen, then I can't get this up. This is basic logic. Right. If I can't get up, then I have fallen. Then I can't get down. But I get up again. Oh, 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 oh. Never going to keep me down. <laughs> like there's an OSHA in this world. It's like a, a six-sided shape on a boat. Gash strike. <laughs> it's a big drink I made up. No, 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 no. You know, yeah, that, that's a that's a cop out. You've got to say what's in the drink. Shit. Shit's in the dead. Sounds like a really bad dream. <laughs> hey, can I just get a glass of shit? Can I get a shit on the rocks? Just, get a, just, just poo in this cup. One. <laughs> I would drink an OSHA violation on the job. <laughs> That's what I would do. You just show up to work and you just talk to your boss. You're like, it's cool if I drink here, right? Oh, that was a really good joke. Which one? The drinking an OSHA violation? Equal parts. Thank you. I'm nervous as a Patreon. Yep. One of no, but he probably has like a little cardboard box you can put money in. Actually, his pockets are constantly full of change, so he doesn't need a Patreon. <laughs> Regular old Sanic the Hedgehog. <laughs> seawater. Uh, I, f I, did, I missed the first two. It was like vodka, gin, and seawater, and grenadine. Sanic. <laughs> Sanic. That's right. He has to and go ice. fast. There's only ice if it's a if it's like an Arctic Mariner sex tuplet. <laughs> these are these are pretty good drinks. Did so story time, right? We had a time where we story had time. all of the uh yes, we're a regular that guy that I can't remember his name. Story time. Um we had a wheel that you built. I that, built a wheel. That we It was three wheels. A, yeah, three wheels and we had a bunch of uh different mixers. It was six fat hexagons. Yes that when you spun them, the edges, I had, we had numbers on them, and we spun all three, and then we had three like columns of like base liquors, mixers, and uh, additives, Yep. and we like spin the three, and, and then like it was that. like, we, it made a drink. And I, I will tell you right now, none of them were good. I don't agree Some with that. Some of them were palatable. So that is all, that is all cataloged on my blog. I have G, all of right? the drinks, all of the pictures yeah. from it, and yeah. all of what happened. Yeah. But it was a lot of fun. It was fun. It was yeah. super fun. Okay. Unfortunately, Fat. And we had to come up with lines. names for them, too. One of them was a booger. Well, we could always Fat, do another three lap. red lines on both Go cheeks showing embarrassment. Is that an emoji? Are you typing out an emoji? Is that an anime? 
up for giving it a try? It might not oh, be yeah, it was, it was more like a... Check out the blog post for more details. <laughs> yeah, search search for the blog. Oh, the it's uwu. A, it's, um... KillerTofu.com. That's my website. Slash, what's the blog? I have no idea what the blog is. What's the just, blog? Just search for drinks or something. Killer Tofu. Drinks. Oh, you got you got us that's those slumber spoons. Fine. Oh, you're getting slumbered. I can't I can't do anything right now. It's because you're sleeping. I know. You got jiggly puffed. Oh, you're gonna die, son. I can't do anything right now. Sleeping on the job, man. An enemy. A karate. Danger! Oh, now Tifa's going to sleep. Still. It's all you, Barrett. I'm trying to stick away from him. What's that? You slap, slap in the ground? On. He's trying to overcharge. He's like... That thing's super dead. All right. Just like Cloud. Yeah, but Cloud's about to get reincarnated. Oh, getting getting scrumbled. Jim's going to scrumble us. The Jimmy's. Uh, the slumbering cloud is a drink. For sure, that's a drink. It, it, uh, it's a hot drink. And then you put a, a clump of cotton candy on top of the glass. And the steam from the drink You're melts the cotton this. candy into the drink. It's like a gastronomy drink. Yeah, that's right. It's got to be a molecular gastronomy. Yes. At a gastro pub. Gastro. At a cocktail gastro pub. Gastronomy. So what would that be? It'd be like a, a hot tea or a, or a coffee drink with a little little Irish Irish it does cost cream thirty whiskey dollar. in there. Got to put some got to put some some uh, some uh, some cotton candy on top. Ooh, melts into it. Melts in your mouth, not in your hands. Second, yeah. Sweetens it up. Ooh, yeah. Also with Benadryl. L mix Sorry. a little Nyquil in. That's just a in. flame and mo. A little Nyquil. With the cough syrup Oof. in there. NyQuil shooter, just really. <laughs> so, a lot of people don't like the taste of NyQuil or, or DayQuil. I don't mind it. I like it. Yeah, I don't mind it. Flamin' Mo is our word. <laughs> <laughs> what am I drinking, Benadryl? Uh, just, just grind it up. You lost? Are you I, lost, I, Cloud? I absolutely am lost because everything looks the same. Well, just switch to Tifa. She knows where to go. Yeah, right. Whoa. I thought I was a flaming mo. Hey. A mo is a mo ma mo mo. It's mo hair. Gotta get a mo hair suit. You're a drug person. <laughs> no, 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 no. It just means I'm an alcoholic. The hey. name is Al. Looking for an alcoholic. <laughs> is there an alcoholic here? We all are here. We all are. <laughs> if I ever find you. <laughs> hey. I think we can climb onto that pipe. Sure seems that way. Red beat me to the joke. I Didn't think I found it. our way. No Momo. Fear, no fear. Yeah, no fear. What are some other ones? No oh, Amanda Hug and Kiss. <laughs> yeah. Fear. I'm looking for Amanda Hug and Kiss. Amanda Hug and Kiss. Yeah, I bet you are. <laughs> Hey guys, no. Is there a B.O. problem here? Do I have a B.O. <laughs> problem? Yes, sure I do! <laughs> <laughs> do I have a B.O. problem? Enough! We gotta keep moving! But that's a big fan. That's a real big fan. No worse than a windy day, huh? No worse than a windy day! Well, a tornado warning, maybe? Don't look at the fan! Whatever you do! Don't look at it, why? Look at it. Look, Look at, at it. You're, yeah, it is a good Barney. Oh, yeah. With, no, yeah. So, Mo, bad. But, yeah, Barney. Somebody the other day was like, hey, you're sounding a lot like Ray Romano today. <laughs> Just shut up. <laughs> Debra. Debra. <laughs> Debra. My brother is tall. <laughs> Everybody loves me. <laughs> It's a huge fan. It is a huge fan. Man, everybody loves Raymond. It's such a great show. <laughs> I like it. And it's like everyone is loves like, you know, friends. Raymond. 
or how I met your mother, and like everyone's sleeping on everybody loves Raymond. Uh, yeah, everyone's sleeping during everyone <laughs> loves Raymond. <laughs> Oh, talk to Reba. You might want to talk oh, to uh, probably Runar a sleeping, a sleeping <laughs> yeah. person sleeping right now. Sleeping Malk. <laughs> Reba. Section H is just up ahead. Slow and steady, guys. Hey, Reba well, McIntyre. <laughs> the cargo platform? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the one. Oh, I could have... Ah, oh, the stupid display was off. What? The little, like, marker to tell me where to go. Could have looked at it. I just had to hit L2. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is it. The cargo platform Biggs was Um, it was, oh. it was okay. It wasn't that away. good. Murphy Brown's not that good. Take it back. No. Take it back. It's like, what, you want to go on Spin City? Uh, that's your show for not to watch is Spin City? Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's like, oh, three lights it was looks a like. boring grown-up show. Murphy Brown's amazing. Not like Everybody Loves boring. Raymond. Isn't it? My Murphy Brown story is just shoot me. We were just just referencing <laughs> that the other day. Um, remember the show he did? Remember the H1 sign. Um, who's in Just Shoot Me? Right, David Spade. Let's see now. Oh no, I'm thinking of a different show. Closest shoot. Light ought to be. Me. That one. What? You said shoot. And I said me. Ah. <laughs> David Spade, just just shoot me. Um, David Spade and uh uh um um. We Kronk. What's his name? Uh, Patrick Warburton. It's yeah, he's in that, right? I don't think so. Uh, he's in something somewhere. with David Spade. So, my Murphy Brown story is one time I was watching Murphy Brown and I ordered a pizza and the person came, it, like I went to the door to get the pizza, I opened it up, she looks in, she goes, are you watching Murphy Brown? <laughs> and I said, yeah. She goes, that's awesome. What a meat cute. <laughs> what a meat cute. Oh, Third Rock from the Sun is the shit. Anything with John Lithgow. I love John Lithgow. So funny. No, but there's a show. It's kind of like Dharma and Greg. <laughs> what a terrible show. But it's with um, uh, his name. I can't remember his name. And so I'm not going to remember. <laughs> and kids? Uh, That's how guy, I met your mother. Who's the guy who played Monk? Uh, Tony Shalhoub. No, okay, so it's not Tony Shalhoub. But he recently had another show that was kind of supposed to be like... Um, Wait. I'm a stupid moron with an ugly, ugly face, face and a, and a big, big butt, butt, and my butt smells, and I like to kiss my own butt. <laughs> stupid moron with an ugly face. <laughs> so funny. That is a good one. Oh, Mom's catching up on the chat. Um, dang it, I lost my train of thought. Oh, it was, it was supposed to be kind of like curb your enthusiasm. Curve it. It was supposed to be like that, and he had like one or two episodes, and it bombed. Let's finish this. Does anyone remember? No. He was in a sitcom, kind of like Darwin Greg, a long time ago. Uh, can't remember. Uh, that is from The Simpsons. That was where, like, they. Th that was like the ending bit, pretty much. For the prank calls. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Ooh, burn. Dead. The four butt. Yeah, The Simpsons. It's from The Simpsons. The four butt joke. Bart prank calls Mo for the last time. And it's that really it's long that, string, he says and he that. says it all. <laughs> my butt stinks, and I like to smell my own butt. <laughs> Doing some good lever pulling right now. A uh, born lever puller. Really mixing a batch over That's here. That's from uh, uh, Yellow Submarine. Four butts is just Hawaiian rolls. Power. My kid loves Please Hawaiian wait. rolls. True Midwesterner. Hawaiian rolls and Only ranch. Two more lights to go. Uh, uh, making <laughs> little sliders. Gonna, little. <laughs> gonna squirt right past you. Get the ranch. <laughs> gonna squirt on over there and grab that ranch from you. If you don't I, mind. I have been saying that well, since I learned it. Oh, yeah. Going to squirt on past you. Can you squirt me that, those napkins? <laughs> squirt on over there. Napkin? <laughs> just squirt my way past. Just, uh, just squirting on over there. They're great, yeah. We'll, we'll make little, like, turkey and cheese or ham and cheese sandwiches with them. Four butts. <clears throat> yeah. Man, all these enemies are just squirting on in. The only problem I have with them is they're so small. So I like to get the Hawaiian, um, Hawaiian bread. Hamburger buns, because those are the perfect size for like a turkey and cheese sandwich. 
Yeah, four whole cigarettes on Wednesdays. This is cheat day. Four butt. Four butt day. One down. Yep, turkey and cheese. Straight from the... Not the deli. The, the pre-cut bags next to the shredded cheese. We can move this catwalk. Um, my younger kid likes to just eat shredded cheese out of the bag, so that's fun. Yeah. Why do they let you? What, why is that something? Like, oh, you gotta line this up. <laughs> like, if you mess it up, are they just gonna run anyway? Of course not. If we can't make sense of this place, we're gonna. And get the lost. praise you just earned for doing that. Yeah, I did it really hey, good. Hey, good job, Cloud! You finally redeemed yourself yeah, in my eyes. I did it really good. Look at these seahorses. Now I think of you like a father figure. You should assess those. You should assess those. First, I should heal myself. I don't know. That's the priority. Here. Yeah, he is pretty right though. Sometimes though, like with dinner, he'll ask for just a pile of that shredded cheese on his plate. The thing is, about half of it ends up on the floor or wherever, just because he just he like eats it like popcorn. He takes a huge handful. And just... <laughs> We are men. Now, we are men. I don't think that's right. It was a show. I think it was the actor's name. It was like the blank blank show, and it was supposed to kind of be like curb your enthusiasm because he played himself in it, and it was like him. Everybody loves Raymond. <laughs> no, it was him trying to get like an acting job. Or like it was him going. Was like, it Matt LeBlanc's? No, not Matt LeBlanc, not Tony Shalhoub, but it was someone kind of similar. And they, he had a show, a long time ago. It was him and this other woman. And I'm terrible with female actors, so I can't remember her name. But uh, it was like, and we were annoyed because it replaced a show that we liked, and we we're like, this show's crap, and it didn't last. And I can't remember. Can't remember what it was, but it was a show that, in my mind, is similar to Dharma and Greg. In that, there's like a man and a woman. <laughs> and narrow, narrowing it down. Mad about you. It was mad about you. Oh, mad about you. He's a video editor. So who's the who's the actor in Mad About You? Uh, that is Paul Reiser and um, uh, Helen Hunt. Helen right. Hunt. I couldn't think yeah. of Helen Hunt. That's I. I knew that was Helen Hunt. So I think it was called like the Paul Reiser Show or something. Let me look that up. Are you sure it was Paul Reiser? That yes, I'm positive it was Paul Reiser. Meaning we've only got one left. The end in sight, y'all. Should be able to climb down from here. The Paul Reiser Show. I spelled Paul wrong. Poor slums down there. Huh? You want to check the knots in time? Yeah, it was I called the Paul Reiser Show. We'll check them Never out saw it. We fall. It had one season. Oh, uh, damn. It did not do well. They read it, Mad About You? Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I did hear that. Yeah. Due to extremely low ratings, the program was canceled on April 22nd, 2011. I say the real son. Ten years that ago. That was so long ago. Yeah. I would not have guessed it was ten years ago. I would have thought, like, maybe five Mork and Mindy, I mean, yeah, I've seen clips. I've seen clips of it. Nanu, yeah. Nanu. Like, I get it. He's an alien. <laughs> I get the whole thing. I get I get the shtick. I, I just get it, okay? <laughs> Robin Williams, he's an alien. How delightful. Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah. Like we, I, we haven't seen this before. I'm in favor. You know, it's not for me, but I can see it. Graham and Trudy. What's the, what's the, two, mup, the two puppets? Uh, and they fight each other a lot. Oh, Punch and Judy. Punch and Judy. Dharma and Punch. Dharma and Greg. Remember the episode where Dharma bought a school bus? What a what a, what a quirky wet, oh, lady. She's so quirky. So weird. She's a regular Phoebe Buffet. A Buffet. Baby Buffet. That was easy. What else we got? We got. Uh, What's the, what's the, what's the, you know what's a show that everyone liked and you it, know, and it, you know, you know what grinds you know my what gears? what grinds my gears? There's too many types of milk. What is the <laughs> deal? No, uh, the show that I can't believe lasted this long is Two and a Half Men. 
Yes, for real, though. How did that show last, what, like 13 years or something? There was, it seems like you'd run out of men. It seems like you'd run out of, like, sexist things to say. No, you'd never run out of that, obviously. The two puppets who fight Burton are, hey, they don't just fight. They're, they just have a complicated they relationship. They have a love-hate relationship, and yeah. we don't get to see the love part. Yeah, Two and a Half Men ran for Because it's on Sesame Street, which is a children's show, okay? They can't film that stuff. <laughs> that is that is what they do for S.A. Jane. You got, it's too Howard in the chat. <laughs> H in the chat. H in the chat. Yeah, and then the young boy, like, grew into a young man, and he was still the half man on the show. Yeah, what the hell? But he was in a movie that Grunart Malk really likes where Bruce Willis meets his childhood self or something. It's a Disney movie, and uh, it's Bruce Willis and the boy from Two and a Half Men. If there's one thing I know about Grunart Malk, he's the only other person I know who likes The Jerk. I haven't seen it. I love people The Jerk. like The Jerk. Yeah, I know, but not enough to where I know him. I haven't seen it. <laughs> there is no Rule 34 to be had between us. Between who? Us. No, it's about Bert and Ernie. Oh, then there sure is. I think. Oh, absolutely. Grimlock is probably sleeping. Although he did, like, surprise me recently with the... Oh, you love the jerk good, too. That is, like, not a not a unpopular opinion. I think that's a really popular movie. I, I know it is. I just don't know how many people who, like, know it and actively like it. You know what's it. good Steve Martin movie? Roxanne. Roxanne. Because it is Cyrano de Bergerac. Oh, I can't make it across here. I was just trying to finish this section. I know we're going long here. Did you ever watch Major Pain? Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Damon Wayans, so right? I don't remember. I was a kid when I saw it, but. Yeah, I, I did think that was a quick jump. He saw Rule 34 and he was like, whoa, 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 I'm playing the game too. Whoa, whoa, like, why are people suddenly talking about this? Like, oh my gosh. Look, I'm saying our chat's being pretty Howard tonight and I wouldn't put it past him. All right, let's just, let's just simmer down a little bit here. I mean, oh my God. Bobby Joe is right upstairs. Yep. Oh, Bobby Joe. You're a, you're a whole, whole lot alive. of women. Uh, if he is, he is like on a ventilator. <laughs> oh, well, that could, not because of COVID, just because of oldness, but he's not old. He's like a regularly <laughs> aged dude. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> Damien Damien Wayne. <White. laughs> <laughs> Why are people talking about these things that I've been thinking for years? <laughs> what things? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why are people talking about these things anyway? <laughs> Where the fuck am I going? Everything looks the damn same. That's a whole mood right there. Okay, I'm calling it. <laughs> Who are you calling? Ghostbusters. Dun -dun 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 Ghostbusters. Oh, Bert and Ernie are like obviously. Obviously. They're just really they're roommates. Sure they are. I now pronounce you Gal and Pal. They are, they are fucking. Up the boots. Good night, everybody. Good night, everyone. We're Thank gonna you go too. Us. We're gonna we're gonna leave. Thanks for chitting in the chat. Yes, in the chit chat. Thanks for being Howard. Hanging at out the, in the after hours. H it seems like chat. after a certain time happened, Howardness came down hard. Yeah, I would say it was like when Ethan joined the chat, but <laughs> it was there the whole time. So. There's a lot of Howard going Just on. It's like 9.30 is the Howard Oh, hey, hour. Tim. Bye, hey, Tim. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> Forcefully, give me a... I, I wish I had a 3080 Ti. I only have a, a measly 3080. Join our Patreon. I and, only uh, have... <clears throat> yeah, we'll do a giveaway because... <laughs> give away. We'll give oh, away whatever my... That is. is it a calculator? No, it's it's the graphics card. The Texas Edge Thank MS 3080. Uh, thanks. Uh, we'll see everybody next week. And next not, time on the next time, I was prompting. I was prompting you. That's not even what we say. We, we, we are anymore. Start my picture. Bye. Yeah, bye. bye.